Hi, I'm Dom Kane, and today I'm going to take a look at Iris from Isotope for PluginBoutique.com. It's a really clever sound design tool for creating multi-sample sounds like nothing else I've ever seen. So let's take a look and I'll show you what it can do. So this is the layout of Iris. It's a sound design tool based on layering and manipulating audio files, which can automatically be assigned to pitches and keys to make the sounds instantly musical. In the middle of the screen here, you can see four different layers of sound. Each one has been visually represented as a spectrograph and frequency analysis file. So if I hold a note down on my keyboard now, you'll see them moving like this. There's also a slider down the bottom here, which allows you to change what you're seeing to become a waveform like this. Now before I go any further into detail, I'll just go through some of the presets available now to show you some of the awesome sounds it's got just built in. You can easily create your own sounds by dragging and dropping audio files into each layer section here like this. Now looking at the left hand side of the synth here, there are a bunch of tools which allow you to cut, copy, paste and highlight certain areas of the spectrograph to be audible which means that you can highlight certain frequencies within a sound. So if, for example, you dragged in a kick drum, but you only wanted the high end of that kick drum in that loop, then you could just highlight that area. To the right of these screens, you can see six little view options here, so that you can get an overview of just layer one, two, three, sub, all, or mixer. As you can see in the mixer screen, there are even more parameters of each voice layer, including mute and solo buttons across the top, and looping and re-trigger options in the LCD displays here. Then there are ADSR, LFO, and effects down the bottom, including distortion, chorus, delay, and reverb. And then on the far right-hand side here are the global filters, LFO, and effects levels. Now finally I'll just finish off with some more sounds from Iris that I've put together earlier on. So that's the basics of Iris and it's available for Mac and PC via PluginBoutique.com now. Cheers. See you soon.